This is the third time I'm doing this voiceover. What the hell? first time i forgot to plug my pc and it tripped off second time i forgot to hit record and i record through the whole video and i found out i i wasn't even recording in the first place so making a little dark type beat you can either make it melodious or make it dark so for this i'll be going for a dark vibe and i am excited a little bit melodious add some melody on top of it but what i have in mind is to make it dark so i made this um button and here i'm filling up um all the empty spaces and coming over to the drums, I made it simple two step hi hats with some rules here and there. And this is a snare made. And this is what it sounds like so far. And I'm just gonna highlight this because I feel like all the bass in the piano is cutting off so much. So highlight this and hold on shift and control and L and paste it up. I'm gonna look for um an EQ. Look for an EQ, cut off to the low end. So it can sound a little cleaner and when i put my a8 or bass it won't clash together so i'm just gonna look for a bell and i like this i'm just gonna do a, a, a three note stuff and starting off with the bass notes with the d i'm just gonna fill up here and duplicate I feel like I might duplicate this one more time. Shift and drag. And that's it. So I'm going to take it one octave here. And start to sound good. So I'm just going to put it here. Control and L. Cut off some of the high end and low end. I actually make it an a bad pass EQ, something like a bad pass EQ. And coming over to the AO8, I actually like making my AO8 on higher octaves, like the seventh octave or even the eighth octave, depending on how the AO8 sound like and what it sound like. And I bring it down to octaves. And as usual, cut off everything except for the hold and cut itself. And this is what it sound like. Even still, I feel like the AOA is weak a little. So I think I'm gonna just add some EQ to kind of like boost up the transient part. And I'm gonna have to change this AOA. It sounds weak. I think I fought with this. So drag and drop. And cause I did some um, adjustments, I think messing up with the sample. Uh, yeah. I thought about adding some distortions and adding some some EQ to like, kind of like boost it up. But I feel like I might have to add a kick later on and switch. And I switched the melody. I switched the melody with a one shot I had. So I think this sounds good and cleaner and gives off that dark hood vibe. And I'm using this melody to this piano to replace the, the bells. And I feel like this shit like is really dark. So I added the pancake, added some EQ and added the reverb. This is what it sounds like without EQ, without any effect. It sounds noisy, sandy and dry and you know me of course if you follow this channel you can, so i can't make a beat without having um, a chord at least the voice i'll be using in nexus and i'm gonna add the bump pass eq as usual and i'm using this bell Nothing dramatic, just cut off some, do some EQ, cut off some of the low end and add a pancake. And I also like this um, piano one shot. And I decided to use, just copy the code I already did earlier and paste it here and do some little adjustment, just like the tiny rows here. And I thought about putting one octave higher, but a low octave kind of like gives me what I want. 
and these strings are used these are strings used in um post smokes do and these are sound like without any effects and these are sound like with effects added um reverb and and this And then I added this sub bass and I fuck with this shit. And as usual, cut yourself, bring everything down and set for the hold. And this is what the drums sound like all together so far. And I added some percussions which I'll be showing shortly. The 8 to 8, I took out the EQ, I took out the distortion, and so I changed it to the kick. And it gives it a, a better punch now, just like I wanted. And this is the kick. Is that the same pattern? And this is my hi hat. So the hi hat, if you have a headphones on, you'll notice that I pan some to the left and to the right. Like here, for example. So you can hear it going from left to right or from right to left. Giving it some ear candy and stuff. And these are the progressions I used. This room. And I kind of like rendered the um, Nexus and some of the other stuff because they were like taking up so much um, CPU even though I was thinking about going to upgrade my system, my PC, upgrading my CPU, yeah. But for now, this is what I make do with what I have. And I'm gonna do some mixing, do some arrangements, and add some effects, yeah. So this is what it sounds like. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you fuck with this and like, share. Yeah, that's about it. Yeah. Oh. Hey. Index Hey. Hey. Yeah. And yeah, like I said earlier, if you noticed, I increased the tempo to 166, making it faster. And once again, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Peace out.